all right guys first of all can we all agree that this is one of the funniest my hero academia images ever bro i never thought for as long as i'd live i'd ever see the words deku and mass murder in the same sentence bro like that shit when i saw that meme bro i was dying laughing but you guys already read the title and you saw the thumbnail right you already know what we're talking about today we're talking about that new my hero academia movie world heroes mission i actually wanted to talk about this a while back when you know like the trailer got released and stuff like that but i'm just finding the time to talk about it now and boy am i hyped for this because my hero academia movies have a track record of being absolutely fire now i have seen the previous two movies two heroes and heroes rising and i have no idea what bones feeds their animators bro i know they got their their movie budget and shit like that but goddamn these movies be looking like beautiful as fuck bro especially especially the endings bro like the climaxes dude like i swear to god like bones they have like a group meeting or something like that and they snort about like 10 lines of cocaine dude because all of the endings to those movies have these like big dramatic heavily animated sequences and just it just looks it just looks fucking beautiful you cannot tell me if you guys saw the ending to two heroes and heroes rising that the endings were not like absolutely fucking gorgeous dude like i said dude like bones they always go ham with those goddamn climaxes so i am really hyped to see this new my hero academia movie bro i'm really hyped to see how they're gonna handle the climax and stuff like that but one thing i'm actually really interested in this movie is the premise because as you guys can tell by the meme one of the premises is that deku is framed for mass murder which when i think about it now it's low-key kind of funny but like i want to watch it to see exactly how it plays out you know because we saw in the promo in the trailers deku todoroki and bakugo real quick we got to respect the drip right yo the, the drip is looking immaculate dude like these new suits like they they look like color coordinated they're kind of like jet black and stuff like that they have like the little symbols on it for like the world heroes it it looks gorgeous i honestly would not be mad if this was midoriya's like canon outfit for the rest of the series dude i absolutely love this look i honestly wouldn't even be mad if he put the goddamn mask in the hood on stuff and stuff like that because you know how i feel about that goddamn Ooh. mask that he has on right now I, I think that does not fit i'd rather him just people just know his identity out front bro because the mask he got on right now is just that shit ain't hitting but this one right here in this movie that he got on yo i honestly shit i'd be rocking that too that should be looking nice as hell and it seems like you know they're gonna be you know obviously it says world heroes mission so they're gonna be you know kind of coordinating with heroes all around the world i assume and, you know we saw hawks in there and stuff like that so i'm really hyped to see exactly what's gonna go down in this movie i don't know if i want to see this in theaters with the old covid stuff but i did see heroes rising in theaters and goddamn bro i do not regret that shit at all bro we actually don't know too much about the movie though as is i believe we only have like one teaser trailer and obviously like the key art but i believe it releases in japan on like august 6th or something like that but honestly i'm not too worried about the wait for it to get released to the west because as far as i can remember the wait for the my hero academia movies usually don't take that long i might be wrong about that and i might be remembering shit different but at least for me i don't remember waiting that long for you know like the past my hero academia movies because like i said before i i know how i always am with anime movies you know we get like we see it on twitter and we see it online like oh shit it's announced and then we gotta wait like ten thousand years and japan gets it like in a couple months you know because we finally get to see the demon slayer movie this month and it feels like it's been a goddamn millennium since i saw the first season of demon slayer and the fact that i finally get to see the continuation is goddamn amazing and we also get the season two and then jujutsu kaisen movie even though i definitely have to wait for that until that gets released in the west but still dude like all these anime movies getting released like i'm just happy i get to see at least one of them soon but yeah guys that's really about it um there's not really too much about the movie yet i'll probably make a video later on in the future whenever we get more information on deku's mass murder mass murder spree I, I cannot take that premise seriously bro but let me know down in the comments below guys if you guys are gonna see this in the theaters or wait until the blu-rays or stuff like that or you know whatever the hell you're gonna do right because in my opinion i want to go to the theaters just so i can see the goddamn ending bro like just so i can see the ending to this shit i want to compare it to the rest bro because right now i gotta give it that I think Heroes Rising has the best ending so far. And personally, in my opinion, let me know if you know if you saw the previous two movies. Let me know what do you think had the best ending and whatnot. But 
yeah guys that's gonna be a little short video today thank you so much for watching like always i appreciate you guys to the fullest make sure to subscribe and hit that bell it's super easy it takes like one second of course you guys can always change your mind later also make sure to click that like button before you head out it really helps the board a lot but nonetheless it's been your boy ivory guys take care and peace